Now this is a huge piece of film. Uh, it's over 60 inches long and about 23, 24 inches wide. So usually I would just take off the piece and put it on, but because this is so huge, we'll do it, do it a little bit differently. Now first make sure that this is completely clean. <clears throat> the film covers from here all the way to here this and goes along this line so all of this needs to be completely clean and let's identify which side is which okay I'll position it first and then I'll spray the car itself. Then spray the film on top like this. Now let's start removing the film from the backing. Let's remove some, some section and then spray the adhesive side. And now I need to fold this like this and I'll just Put it here and squeeze it a little bit. We'll reposition later, just so that I have some adhesion, so that I can just remove the other part uh, without risk of um, damaging the film. Oh, good. If you have someone to help you, that's a lot easier. Now, we need to position it properly. For this, we need a lot of water. And now start on one end. This. Now I'll kind of try to guide it by the top side. Uh, I need some more water. Make sure it doesn't stick out here. Mm. 
Now I'll use the squeegee to position it so that it stays in place. Now just do it like here. And now I'll keep it like that. Spray on top so that the squeegee moves freely. And start removing the water from top to bottom. Now, as soon as you get to this part here, where it's already positioned uh, and you have some adhesion on the top, you're good. From here on, it's much, much easier. Don't worry about damaging the film, like when it falls and stuff. This is uh, paint protection film. It's very good. It doesn't damage so easily. The only thing you need to be careful about is if you don't have water, the film might stick to itself when you're handling it. So if that happens, uh, very carefully just separate the two parts. But other than that, it's a great film, nothing to worry about. Make sure you take the water here at, at the curve this notice that I keep spraying on top and the reason is that this is a rubber squeegee and it, it will drag against the film if the film is not very slippery. That's why we need uh, that water on top. If you missed any tiny bubbles here and there, just leave it and in a few days it would, they would disappear. Make sure you don't use a car wash in the next couple of days after installation. And that's about it. If you have a bubble that doesn't disappear in a few days or a water pocket, uh, just pop it with a needle. Like for instance, I have one here, I just saw it. I'll try to take it up, but if it doesn't want to, I'll leave it for a few days, and if it's still there, I'll just use a needle and carefully pop it. And look it though, because it's moving. And I got rid of it. That's it.